Hey race fans and welcome to another edition of our Race Across America Daily Recap. I'm your host, Jarek Wilhelmsen. Now, Race Across America has several different categories within it. We have our solo riders, our two-person, four-person, and eight-person teams, but we also have different types of bikes. Our Media 2 reporter, Brendan Martin, takes a look at the recumbents. So, Brendan, take it away. What up, Jarek? It's Brendan Martin here in the Media 2 vehicle, and we're chasing down these riders to bring you the best information. We did catch up with a guy today, Timothy Wootenberg, racing for the first time on Solo, not the team event, and he's on his recumbent bike. Comfort, and of course, a lot of people get them because they just want to be different. But to me, it was comfort because I got to where I could do a century rides, but around 60 or 70 miles, it was like everything started to hurt. My first ride on a recumbent, after about 75 miles, I realized nothing hurt. Um, they're horribly expensive, really, compared to a Walmart bike, but they're fast because they're more reclined usually. Uh, they don't climb as well because you can't stand up to pedal, but the comfort, the difference factor, and the fact that and you can go out and ride 100 or 200 miles and you don't even feel like getting off of it. Well, that'll do it for me. We are on the road in Kansas, crossing over to Missouri and not too long. And I think I see a rider. We'll get back to you soon. Hey, thanks a lot, Brendan. Really neat stuff. Now, you know, several of the teams within RAM race RAM for a specific reason. And it's not just to have a really good time. It's to bring awareness and funding to their favorite charity. And a lot of these charities are very near and dear to their heart. So let's take a look at the different charities represented by the teams in RAM. Team To Kill HD. To Kill HD. To Cure. To Cure. Yeah. What Hunting, Huntington's disease. What, what's your personal reason for riding? My best friend, Renato, who's on the team with me, his wife has Huntington's disease. One more time. Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation, JDRF. Do you have a website? Yes. What's that? TeamJDRF.org. Durham Cares. Oh, awesome. Raising money for 18 charities in North Carolina. Give a shout to us. Hey, what's your website? DurhamCares.org. Check us out. So Team Donate Life. Oh, beautiful. Raising awareness for organ donation and transplantation. We got the 12 year old boy on our team, Connor. He's got a liver disease. He's probably gonna need a transplant at some point in his life. So our team's called Connor's Hope. TeamDonateLife.com. Check us out. Auctioner. You have a charity? Oh uh, yeah, uh, Childhood Obesity. And what website can we find you at? Um, I think it's auctioner.com. But I'm Lawrence Cohen. And you can go to my website or neworleans.com. We're from New Orleans. All right. I wish the best of luck to you, sir. Thank you. Cheers. Yeah, we're representing oh, hold up. Help for Heroes. I'm sorry, one Help more time. Help for Heroes, which is the same as the Four Mill. It's the UK version of Four Mill's Wounded Warriors. Do you have a website? Yeah. www.raf-ultra.co.uk. 408, we're the Georgia Chain Gang. Oh, there you go. I yep. just got a. I just uh, met one of your uh, crew people that gave me a pen. That's right. Now, now, what motivates you to ride? We were raising money for leukemia, and we've raised 95000 so far. Now, how about yourself? What is the personal connection? Uh, my sister died of leukemia, my father-in-law, and my uncle. I would say that's good motivation. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So as you can see, many of these riders have a very personal reason for riding. So why don't we give them a hand and go to their charity's website to see how we can help. 
Would you like to find out about some of the other charities that are represented by the teams in RAM? Well, why don't you go to our website at www.raceacrossamerica.org. If you go on to the different riders or teams pages, they'll have listed the charity and the website for it that they represent. So why don't you go check those out? And keep tuning in as the Race Across America travels across this country. And in the meantime, we'll see you out there.